Yo, what is up, peepers? Welcome back to It's Game Time, where life is a game and game is life. And for this game episode, I'm gonna be showing you how to complete the third quest entitled Find Me here on Build a Boat for Treasure. But before we move on to the game, as always, I upload new videos two to three times a week, either on my main channel and or here on my gaming channel. So please consider subscribing and hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you'll get notified whenever a new video is up. So without further ado, let's head into the game. So to start the quest, of course, you have to go to the change teams, go to the quest icon and click on the third one, which is find me. And again, I have completed this quest. That's why I have already the check, the green check here. But for the sake of this tutorial, I'll be doing the quest again. So to start the quest, all you have to do is to click on find me and click on start quest. And by completing the quest, you get uh, 25 blue glue blocks, five buttons, three levers, and 1,000 gold. But the quest rules, you may not attach blocks to your avatar. So click on start quest to start the quest. But I'm not sure why it's telling me to clear blocks. I don't have any blocks, but whatever. Clear all. Yes, and let's start the quest again. Start quest. All right, so the quest has started. So what you have to do is to go here on the butter block. That's the first step of the quest. Yep, here. And click that. And it will disappear. So all you have to do is to find the next block, which is usually on top of you. <laughs> so the second step is uh, click the block, which is right there, right on top of me. And it's quite simple. If you have a ladder, I'm not sure if this is a ladder, but I call it a ladder. Uh, make sure that you'll get to it. You don't really need to get uh, right in front of it. Just closer to it would be fine and you will be able to click it. So that's how I will do this. I'm not sure if I can click it already, but let's do this. Okay, I'm close to the block and now I can click it. And it will magically disappear again. And the third one would be right there. So it's not really challenging. All you have to do is to clear this one. And yeah, make another ladder here to reach the block. But the challenging part here is the last one, which is right after this one. So let's do this first. Again, I'm just gonna do gonna st uh, stack the ladders. If this is really a ladder, tell me if it's a ladder by commenting down below. <laughs> Because I call it a ladder. All right, so the third one would be like this. Once you click it, you'll see that. Oh, this is not the last part. Ah, uh, this is second to the last part. So the block, the butter block, will get to the top of the flagpole. So this is quite challenging because you oh, you can only build here on this area. I actually saved the build that I created for this. So I'm just gonna show it to you instead of rebuilding it. So this is what I did. I saved it. I think I saved it here. I'm not sure though. Did I? Yeah. So so this is what I did. So basically, once you run the simulator, uh, or once you launch the game, this will clear up as always. This will turn into a water, and then this will get pulled, and it this tower will lean towards the flagpole. And once it leans to the flag, let me go ahead and zoom this, in. zoom this out. So this is what I did. Uh, this will hook to the flag. So what I sh what I did here is to put a chair right here. This is that's what I'm gonna do now. So I did put a chair here, as far as I can remember. Uh, it's quite challenging, but okay, we can do this. Hey. Ah, move. There we go. This is what I did. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, as you can see, there's no ladder in here. So just like what I did on the first build. Ooh, what happened here? Uh, I'm not sure though. Let's see if it's gonna work. So just like what I did on the first build, I I just stack up the ladder and go as I build it and remove the the ladders that I have passed. Okay, remove this. 
the and just remove the letters behind so I could use them as I move up so just like this uh, let's sh I'm gonna show this to you real time not gonna speed up the game I'm just gonna show to you speed uh, real time sorry so yeah be careful in removing the letters but if you have a lot of letters like this you don't need to do this step you don't need to remove uh, the ones that you have placed but since I have limited number of letters I have to do it so yep remove the ones that I have completed so you really have to be careful in doing this because you don't want to start over if you fall so be be really careful because it's this is quite high I'm not really sure how how many blocks I placed in here but yeah I did save it I did a lot of trial and error for this but at least you know what to do in case you're you're on this uh, quest as well so yeah let's do this first uh, you go up here first and be careful in jumping all right so I'm gonna remove the ladders that I have placed here and make my way to this portion so uh, I'm gonna go up here so you really have the, the you really, you really really have to be careful in doing this because it's quite hard so it, for me not to fall I'm gonna place uh, blocks in here no 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 not, not there I'm gonna place some blocks here uh, mm, not enough blocks uh, so just so I would have something to to walk on right there and then head here of course you have to remove the block so it won't interfere on your build so what I usually do here so what I actually did here is to create a platform where I can you know safely walk yes but I'm gonna remove this after I have made the ladder so just so I am safe here while I'm doing this the next build so again I'm gonna use the ladder Place the ladder over here. Can I use the ladder now? And once you get here, you will automatically sit. There we go. So remove the ladders and remove everything that you have placed. And now the magic. Here comes the magic. So we're gonna. Oh, let's remove the ladder here. So let's run the game. And I will show you how this will work. There you go there we go there so you got blocked and then you can click on the block there we go and again it will magically disappear and the final block would be right there yeah would be right there there on top of that uh, first stage you have to clear the stage first clear all and then the final build I did the same thing same concept it's just that it's the same concept basically everything is the same concept as my first build I'm just gonna load it up uh, is this the right thing yeah this is the right build I think so yep just let's wait for this to so, see as I have mentioned it's the same build as my build for the first quest so basically it's the same so again we're gonna go up there so let's put some ladder let's show uh, this time I'm gonna speed up the game till I get to the till I get to the top all right so I'm gonna speed up the game now Alright, so we have reached the top of the tower, so I'm just gonna delete the the excess ladder. So basically we are just gonna launch this and let's hope that we get there safely because that's where the last piece of the block is located. So let's launch this. 
So the reason why I made a big base is so that the tower would be stable. And let's hope that I'll get to the that part of the of the stage safely because that's where the last block is located. And yeah. Oh, this is nerve-wracking. All right, just a few more. Okay, we're close, we're close. All right, you can just jump safely here. And click on the block. There we go. And once you click that, you'll receive all the rewards. And I'm not getting the rewards because I have completed this already. Right. So yeah, that's how you complete the third quest entitled Find Me Here and Build a Boat for Treasure. I hope you learned something new today and I hope I did help you in completing your quest. So if you did uh, like this video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the no the subscribe button and notification bell so you'll get notified whenever your video is up. Again, my name is RG and I will see you all next time. And I'm out. Bye bye